Oh, guys, trouble came from where we didn't expect. Such a terrible news these last days. It's hard for me to say, but Viagra has left Russia. This is just a blow for all Russians. Do you see it here in a pharmacy? No. What can we do? It's just a punch in the gut for all Russians. Hi, guys. My name is Marina. And yeah, it's true. American pharmaceutical company Viatris reported that they stopped uh, to supply Viagra tab tablets to Russia. And I decided to check Viagra stocks in several pharmacies. And at the same time, I want to show you how our Russian pharmaceutical um, industry works. Let's start. Uh, let's start with the local pharmacy near my house. This pharmacy is rather good. Not cheap, but you can find here and buy all you need. Of course, I asked a seller. She sent me no Vagra. Maybe four months already. But what can I see? And these tablets are the same. And truth be told, there is a groundbreaking replacement in Russia. Just have a look. This is from Poland. And the rest of tablets are typical Viagra from Russia. But uh, you must have a recipe to buy it. Guys, what do you think? If all world famous companies leave Russia, the global economy will be in a pickle. As for me, I still don't have a clue what's going on really. But today, the main problem is Viagra. And uh, I'm going to visit the second pharmacy. Maybe I will find this miracle for all men in the world. Hmm? And now it's chance for, uh, for cheap pharmacy to show their assortment. Hello, здравствуйте. Um, я ищу Viagra. I'm looking for Viagra. У вас уже тоже, наверное, ее нет, да? No Viagra, my dear viewers. But I'm sure there are a lot of replacements. Ah, oh, yeah, I see. I see. All these. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I see it's from uh, pill, uh, tablets for men from Croatia and from, from Slovenia and again uh, Russian replacement. And good prices, but you also need a recipe for sure. But you can use it. No problem in Russia at all. Viagra, bye bye. See you next century. Okay, you see that situation with the tablets and different um, medicine and medical equipment is not getting out of hand in Russia. And I'm going to visit another pharmacy uh, right in the center of Moscow. And I have a special bonus for you. Just watch my video till the end. Guys, do you remember Arbatskaya subway station from my previous video? Here is the link. And having driven for one hour and 15 minutes, finally I'm here in the center of Moscow and I'm, I'm getting out uh, of the station Arbatska with the help of Escalade <laughs> to Arbat Street, historical street. Uh, Arbat is worth seeing for sure and worth visiting. But today we have a special task. We are looking for what? Yes, Viagra in pharmacies. 
oh, here it is, my dear viewers. Uh, the most famous pedestrian street in Moscow, Arbat. Historical buildings, historical cafes and restaurants, and a lot of historical souvenir shops. And of course, of course, over there, uh, there are historical pharmacies. Uh, maybe, maybe we can find in a historical pharmacy such a necessary Viagra. Oh, I see it. I see this historical pharmacy in historical surroundings. Arbat is a nice place, you know, for having walk for just for spending time uh, with families, but not today, not today. Oh, central pharmacies look different, <laughs> not like in suburbs. Great space, and maybe we'll have a chance to find Viagra here. Да, скажите, пожалуйста, а есть у вас Виагра uh, еще? Do you have a Viagra? Still? Вы до сих пор есть? Так она же ушла из России. А can you show me? Yes, they have Viagra. А <laughs> can you show me, please? Wow. Yeah. Can you see that? <laughs> Pfizer Viagra. А сколько стоит? The price is awful, 5,000 rubles. 5,000 rubles for two tablets. But yes, 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 we have found it. Yes, we are lucky. And now, and now, one, two, three, it's time for surprise. What is this? What do you think? It's condom store. Mmm, I've never been there inside and I think I have a chance right now to see what's inside and to show you. Oh my gosh, no comments. Oh, YouTube can block me <laughs> if I'm going to comment something. just in the very historical center of Moscow. I don't see the prices, maybe it's all priceless. Uh, this is uh, just a uh, soap. And let's check the prices. Mm, 430 rubles. Oh, it's about maybe six or seven dollars for package. Sorry guys, but I'm not going to ask prices for, for all stuff. And this section is for for you, maybe, <laughs> to make love. Mm. Would you like to taste something? Mm, nice design. Would you like to have the same uh, at home? And here is um, just Russian fairy tales on another wall. Guys, I'm shocked a little bit. <laughs> Historical street, just souvenirs, bakeries and condom store. 
I want to notice, my dear viewers, that family in Russia is a traditional family. It means man and woman, he plus she. Of course, I admit that there are some unpredictable situations in life and life is so different and sometimes unusual. And I respect uh, people of different orientations. But for Russia, family is man and woman. It's a law. Thanks to our government and our vice president, Mr. Putin. And here is a link to my videos about prices in different grocery stores of Russia.